it's Dr. Ennis back again. This time I want to guide you through a process of using mindfulness and your breath when you're in a stressful situation, in a stressful moment. And a reminder, this takes practice. Um, practice the mindfulness of tuning into how you feel and then practice this exercise where you're actually applying it to real life situations. Yeah, okay. So let's maybe close your eyes. If you're comfortable doing that, close your eyes. If you're not, you can leave them open. But I want you to imagine a stressful situation, like a recent one. And you're th if you're thinking zero to 10, 10's the worst, don't pick a 10. Pick something that's a five or a six, but a five, okay? We just want something in the middle to work with. You need to build up the skill before you try doing this with really super stressful situations. So imagine that situation and maybe it's a conflict with your partner or a deadline at work or um, an irritating person at work who I don't know, won't stop talking to you or a difficult customer. So just see them in your mind, see the situation like it's a movie and you're in it and see yourself and feel the, tune into your body in this movie, tune into how you're feeling physically you might notice that you're clenching or your shoulders are pinched up. You might notice you're looking down because you're really uncomfortable or maybe you're furrowing your brow because you're getting irritated. So notice both the physical feeling of it and the emotional feeling of it. And even notice what your brain's doing which might be complaining about the person or it might be criticizing yourself or some of both. Okay, just kind of tune into all of that lightly. Now, as you're doing this, I want you to tune, feel your feet on the floor wherever you happen to be right this minute as you're imagining this. Say you're sitting in a chair. I want you to feel the weight of your body sitting on the chair. Feel the back against your back. Feel your hands resting wherever they are. Feel yourself breathing. And see if you can breathe a little more deeply into your belly. Breathing into your belly and then making your out breath even longer than the in breath. And you might even try breathe in for three two, three, and out for six, out, two, three, four, five, six, and do a, a few more of those as you're watching this little movie. This helps activate the parasympathetic nervous system, the relaxation response. And as you're looking at this movie, and you're breathing deeply, slowly. As you breathe in, I want you to imagine that your breath is kind of expanding your energy beyond you, right? So breathing out. And you're breathing and you're expanding your energetic bubble around you, okay? We have a um, biomagnetic field. Our body emits electromagnetic energy. The, um, I forget the distances, but the heart radiates out six, eight, 10 feet. The brain, I mean, our whole body radiates out electromagnetic energy. So as you breathe in, imagine filling yourself from the universe, you breathe in. And as you breathe out, 
imagine expanding your energy around you, like all the way around you beyond your fingertips. So you're in a bubble in every direction, okay? And you're watching this other person and you're watching yourself and the interactions with them. And you might notice that they actually move out a little further as your bubble moves out, they move out, which is good. It gives you a little more space. And imagine as you breathe in, your bubble expands, feeling your feet on the floor, you're kind of grounding down and you're creating more space and calmness in your own system. Do this while visualizing a few times and then see if you can try it in the moment. And you might just start with trying to be aware of how you're feeling in the moment. As soon as you notice something's kind of stressful, see if you can slow down your breathing and expand your bubble and see what happens. All right, let me know. Be well.